What's going on guys, my name is JD, in today's video, let's take a look at Tom Brady. Oh, he went to Disneyland. So let's do that, let's talk a little bit about that, and let's see what's been going on, um, like around the Buccaneers, and like, I'll talk to you guys about AB and stuff. So we're gonna do a Tom Brady video today, let's go. Alright, so before I start, last week's Tom Brady video did awesome, alright? I think it was like a 250 views, within like the first day. Unbel unbelievable, unreal. Thanks, guys. And if you have not checked that one out, go check it out. Because if I had that many views and that many likes, then, you know, it's got to be good, right? So check it out. The reason I'm saying that is because my other videos get, like, three views or four views, right? And then there's always going to be that one video that just takes off. So that video is that. And I did get a huge subscriber increase, right? I don't know if that was, like, you know, uh, YouTube bots. Because I know I knew a few YouTubers were getting hit by that. But, you know, I just hope that it's, like, real subscribers. If it's not, I just hope YouTube gets rid of those people, all right? All right. Let's get into the topic. Number one, Tom Brady, man. He went to, he went to uh, Walt Disney, right? And he, he, of course, is like always just joking around, having fun. He talked about how he goes there. And he said that the reason he's playing is because, like, he gets to go free trips to Walt Disney. Yes, he said it as a joke. But, you know, if you're other players and you've never beat him in a Super Bowl, if you've never been there... And you're thinking to yourself, like, damn, bro, like, this guy gets there every single year and he's making a joke out of it. Meanwhile, it's so tough for us to get there. So, yes, it is, you know, it's pretty funny, but it's always shots given whenever Tom Brady speaks, right? So, besides that, he gave an interview to Michael Strahan, right, one of his friends, the Gap guy. And they ended up, you know, hitting it off. And they were talking about it. And then he basically just said that his doubters and his haters, that's what like, fuels him. He just keeps going. And he's not a, he's not a huge fan of, you know, Hitting them one on one, which I agree, right? Brady's not the kind of guy where you kind of walk up to him and you're like, "Hey, Brady, I said this about you." He's not gonna be like, "Hey, guess what, man? I know you said that about me. Look at me, I got seven rings. You said I would stop at two. He's not the guy who's gonna say that. You know, he's gonna be like, when he goes to bed, he's gonna be like, "All right, that guy, I got him. He said that, right?" But he's not gonna say it to the guy to his face. So Brady's pretty chill that way, right? More on his uh, Walt Disney uh, journey. So there was, there was some funny moments, like, for example, he went and then they had the Jedi stuff, right? The Star Wars Jedi, not this <laughs> Jedi, but yeah. So he went there with the Star Wars stuff, and then he was doing the, the fight thing, whatever that's called. Like, oh, yeah, the Jedi Academy with the sons. He was out there, and then, of course, <laughs> um, one of the Sith guys came out, and they were like, the Force is strong with this one. You must join the dark side. And then uh, the, uh, there was, so that was pretty funny because they went up for Brady and said, hey, Brady, you should join the dark side. And Brady was like, nah, I want to play for a winning team. So that was pretty funny. It was pretty cool. Brady's just out here having fun. As long as he gets everything back, our starters are back. Oh, in, in the next Buccaneers video, I'm going to be talking about Antonio Brown. So stay tuned for that. Other than that, three minutes mark. I'll see you tomorrow. Brand new video. Bye.